Clip that. Please clip that. That looks so fucking cool. Please clip that. It's always nice to be able to get something new for the British because they're a nation that isn't entirely well rounded, at least not in my opinion. Now, let me explain what I mean by that. Top tier Britain is kind of an iffy spot, right? Sure, you have the Challenger 2s. Now, they're brilliant vehicles. Don't get me wrong, they can get the job done but they kind of lack behind a lot of the other nations, not just in, say, firepower, which I think is pretty good for the most part, but in one crucial area, and that is mobility. Now, take a look at, say, the ZTZ-99A. Now, this is a brand new vehicle. It's a superb one of that, too, and this vehicle is brilliant, not because it has 7.1 seconds of uh, firepower or uh, reload rates, or it has decent armor, but because it moves really, really well. 75 kilometers an hour, which I forgot to mention in the video of this. But point being is that mobility is absolutely key at high tier. I know some may disagree, but that's just my own personal experience with top tier. But I'm not one who can just say no to new things. And so here we have the Challenger Desert Storm, a vehicle that is a uh, Something that came as a bit of a surprise to me, especially seeing that uh, it has some specific capabilities, which we'll talk about in today's video. But as always, before we go ahead and get into that, uh, just a, a quick little two things, actually. One of them is, if you are a creator or an artist of someone who works with uh, effects, uh, video effects, etc., I, I don't even know how to describe it, to be honest. If you're someone who can make some really badass intros, trailers kind of stuff, uh, feel free to hit me up. I might have a job for you. I do want to get a new intro for the YouTube side of things to be a permanent thing because the one I had previously is kind of bad. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry if I'm being too honest here. But if you're someone like that, hit me up either in the comments, uh, put your contact information over uh, in DMs on Twitter or Discord. Discord is probably a better area to get a hold of me. You know, the link to everything is down in the description through my server. So easiest way to get into contact with me. So uh, the second part is a 3% discount. You know the whole spiel. If you have a plan uh, to ever buy this vehicle, or maybe you're on the fence to get it, uh, just use my 3% discount. It benefits you. I get that 3%. You get my in-game decal. What is not to love, right? By the way, this camo pattern is very nice, but might be a little too shiny for my liking in most maps. But anyway, so let's go ahead and get into, I guess, the meat of this vehicle. What does it really bring to the table? It's a 9.7 premium Challenger. That's it. <laughs> in fact, it's the, uh, which one is this? It doesn't even tell me. It's the Mark III. That's right. It's the Mark III, which just adds on to the already existing Challenger Mark III and the Mark II, except that this one does not get the better APFS DS. That is the L26 round, I believe it is, for the uh, for the Mark V version. I just got to triple check that really quick. Yes, it is the L26. Instead, it gets everything that that vehicle would otherwise have, except the amount of firepower, as this only has the L23A1 APFSDS, which is a very good shell type for the BR, don't get me wrong, but it's not quite the L26, but at 9.7, it'll get the job done. Besides, Gaijin might actually change that and give it the L26, much like how they did with the uh, with the Mango round for the T72 AB terms. But aside from that, it is the exact same thing. Same armor, same mobility, same reverse rate, same vertical targeting speed, which is very good, by the way, 19 degrees a second. And this is not an expert crew, mind you. So that does make up for a lot. Good optics for the most part, uh, bad commander optics. It's just the norm, right? Nothing really special about this, except that it's a premium vehicle, which means that you can research tier one all the way to tier seven without ever having to touch the tech tree in itself is a big problem but we'll get more into that a little bit later so with all that being said let's take this bad boy out and see how it performs in the oversaturated 9.7 oh god this is gonna suck oh. <laughs> all right let's go now this is the perfect setup a desert map for the desert storm tank i guess it kind of fits although this is based off arizona but that's not the point but anyways 15 rounds of darts four hesh rounds i i don't know why i carry hesh rounds but I just do in a whole buttload of uh, premiums. 
Oh shit, guys, this is uh, a <laughs> this is kind of what you're gonna be expecting when, if, and when you buy this thing. Just saying. Oh, vehicle front, hi. Are you serious? Undamaged? I have a way better reload than you, buddy. What was that undamaged? Really? <laughs> what? What was that? What did I hit? Now he's, he's dead, but I couldn't hear him. Oh man, dude, the audio in this game is a little wonky. Ooh, another one on the right. Driver gunner, backing up, backing up, backing up. Okay. I give it to the British for at least having some good reverse speed with their chalies. Uh, mm, I don't trust this. No, I don't trust this. Go ahead, teammate. Go, go, go. Yeah, he sees you. He knows we're here. Oh, he shot. And he's got no loader. Hey, buddy. Bye. Boop. Beautiful. Awesome. Uh, oh, 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 God. There's just too many. They're all over the place. It's all right. I got to back up. I know I shouldn't be taking the same route again, especially after the first time. But uh, my teammates have just knocked, uh, not knocked out. They've marked some targets right over here. Let's see if I can nail them. There he is. Oh, I hear something front. Ooh. Yeah, that'll, that'll, uh, that'll happen, buddy. <clears throat> At least I avenged you. Excuse me. I just had dinner. You got him? Nice. <laughs> There's so much activity right now. Holy shit. There we go. Got one perfect. L44. Another one. ZSU 23-4. I think. Yes. Gotcha. Got another one. Oh my god. All over the place. I think I have an idea. Nope. That didn't work. I, I want to shoot through. The, oh, I can't shoot through that building. Huh? Never mind. Never mind. Take that back. Oh, what the? What? I, oh, hi. Thanks for, uh, holy crap. How did I not die, dude? He just went right through my tank and did nothing. Oh, God. Oh. All right. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. <laughs> oh, my barrel just ate that missile. I thought I shut it down for a quick second. Oh, that was, uh, seven kills deep, though. That was stressful. What is that? Is that a helicopter? Oh, no. Um Nope, that didn't that didn't work. Yeah, game's over anyway. <laughs> I'll take it. I guess when you're at battle rating 9.7, you get to face all the 9.7s, which means that Russia has their 9.7s full of terms, etc., which means that they are also going to have their one death levers. But we're just about the same. I'm not even kidding. Look at this. This is just you know, those are using it. More power to you, but this is why I avoid 9.7 like the plague. All right, that's that's just me. But anyways, this is a CQB environment. Let's get into some good fights. I do want to use that best round. I might not be able to, but I'm gonna damn well try. Ooh, hey, I got a striker kill with the Artie. Nice. <laughs> Come on, Artie kills are always incredibly satisfying. Oh shit. Um, I got one. A guy's breaching everything. I got a good reload on this. Come on. Pick someone. Nope, not XM1. Woo. I can make this work. Oh, I don't know why I'm just fat fingered it like that. By the way, your turn face cannot absorb MA29. Just saying. Oh, I can't see. Come on. Got a crit. Beautiful. Oh, we're making this fight fun. Come on, fire. All right, we're good, we're good. You know what? I really should put an expert crew on this, huh? Nice. Well done, teammates. Ooh, bad shot on my part. You know what? I'm loading the hash round. Yeah, little BMP, you're getting a hash round. Why are you running? Now come back! I loaded hash just for you! <laughs> In front. BMP. Uh, nope. If he fired a missile at me, I would have been dead. And the hash round would have not done anything to him right there. Cool. Oh no! Ugh. Why'd you just use your gun? You had me side on. <laughs> All right. Is that a BMP out here to my right? Yep, there he is. 
I have an idea. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do, uh, I'm gonna make a regret, a mistake. I know, it. this is not gonna help me. I can already tell. But I wanna damn well try. That BMP is where I think he is. I'm gonna hit him right in the back of the turret with his hash round. Oh, is that him? That's him! Yes! I bet somebody finally! <laughs> oh, that was satisfying. Come on, that was satisfying. I go, it sounds. I'm gonna take a wild guess. It's that uh, Bradley we saw earlier. He just wiped out our, one of our teammates over here. Uh, I could be entirely wrong. Man, why does this thing have to be so freaking slow? There he is. Nope, it's a. It's a BMP. I don't think he knows we're here. We, he's got a Russian NATO hump thing. I don't know. He has a hard time. Never mind. He doesn't. I just, I made a clear mistake. Well played. You know what? I'm not going to let this game go. Nuh uh. Just because we lost both of them, I didn't feel like we performed well in this thing. I mean, come on. We're, yeah. Yeah. Look at this. <laughs> I'm going to bring this bad boy out. I'm going to go dogfine just for a little bit. I do have A9Gs on this and a couple of bombs and a whole lot of aircraft. So you guys are gonna have to share these missiles. First one up, mm, let's get the A10 first. I just don't want him to see me because those A9Ls, they're disgusting. Oh God, does he see me? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Going guns. There we go, perfect. Guys, if I fail at this, I'm sorry. Nope, he's done. Beautiful. Whew, let's get this guy next if we can. Whoa, head on. Yeah! God, oh, bleh, he got me too. I couldn't even drop my bombs. No! <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. Ground Zero, this is a, this is an interesting one. I haven't played this in a little bit. Not exactly one of my favorite maps per se, but it's more of a, uh, a personal thing, right? How come we get, you know, American Desert and we get a destroyed American city that is Alaska? Why don't we get something along the lines of Russia or a destroyed Russian map that isn't World War II? <laughs> just, I know, I know, right? I'm just being that typical American. I don't like to see a destroyed American city, but you know, fair is fair, right? Give us a, uh, give us Red Square, maybe. I like to fight them there, just saying. But anyways, let's make this one good because uh, we got a CQB fight ahead of us. Oh, first up, got him, perfect. I was actually really slow on that shot too, so he could have had me easily, but since he was the uh, M2C, he had thermals. I should have anyways. All right. There's one. Gotcha. Driver gunner, perfect. He knows where I'm at though. His DM-23 round. No, he's got DM-43, huh? Easily go through my turret face. Ugh, God. All right, no lost crew, we're good. The problem with this shot is, uh, might be able to help me, are you? Come on, no, yes, there we go. Perfect, I won't have enough time to get that shot in though. Hostile vehicle front, I hear him. Other side of this building, I think. Mm. Yep, it's our little thump thump friend right there. Now here's the problem with that. He can shoot us in the lower front plate and, oh no, thank you teammate. Oh, really? Wait, how'd you mess up that shot? Really? How did you mess up? Wait, how? That is... Oh, come on. Turn, 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 turn. He doesn't know we're here. He doesn't know. Gotcha. I'll be honest. I still don't know how I survived that shot. I should have been dead. Just saying. I got a hostile vehicle coming up this way. I, I don't want him to get behind me. Here he comes. Come on, come on. Pivot, you chunky shit. Oh. Pop a smoke. Ooh. I've got zero trust. Woo. My God, that was annoying. This thing wouldn't pivot. Oh, God. Oh, no, 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 no. I got to move. I got to move now. Let's go. Pop smoke. Woo. Ah. Uh. Uh. <laughs> that was good, though. I got to back up. Let's make it count. I got one front. That bagel's still alive, by the way. He did wipe out a teammate, but he's not capping the points. I, I hear him, but why isn't he capping? I, I think he's just going for the kills. Oh, I hear a lot of things in front of me. 
Yeah, I'm pretty sure this guy is just going for the kills. I think he's trying to get behind me. I think he knows I'm coming. Because you can hear this thing a mile away. You know that, right? Come on. Come on, come on. There you are. Hey, buddy. Got. Really? You didn't get your gun? All right. A little bit of payback, I think. <laughs> All right, let's keep this going. Got another vehicle front. I swore I saw him for a second. What is it? Oh. I'm so sorry, little one. I know you mean well, but damn. <laughs> you know what? He can actually kick my ass from the front, probably. I wasn't going to risk that, okay? <laughs> Got him in front. Oh, I hear something. I was like, he's coming this way. Yep, there he is. Has no idea. Perfect. <laughs> I was about to say, uh, if you are new and you get this vehicle, please do not use ESS because you can see. Oh, that's, that's my engine. Sounds chunky. You can see through ESS with thermal sights, any generation of thermal. So all it does is it blinds you. It blinds your teammates and it gives your position away. Oh, that's friendly I'm hearing. Okay, cool. So yeah, don't use ESS unless you know for a fact your opponent does not have thermal sights. Leopard 2Ks, T72As, uh, etc. But everything around this BR has thermal sights. Keep that in mind. He was alive. Okay, I'll take the last skill. So how about another piece of advice? Don't carry more than 15 rounds of Sabo unless you're in a position like this where we will be sniping. So, since I'm going to be sniping the whole damn time, I brought a full rack because of exactly this right here. There we go. Ooh, bounce. Okay. I'll continue that in just a quick second. Hang in there, guys. There's that one. That's, that's actually another guy I was aiming for, to be honest, but it worked. There we go. Damn. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> it's always satisfying to see. Oh, boy. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and go to my sniping spot in the rear. I just want to knock out a couple of kills here first. But uh, the reason why I say that is because this thing, again, is a walking ammo wreck. Like, look how much ammunition this thing with uh, 45 plus rounds. It's pretty ridiculous. And this thing will pop very easily. So keep that in mind when you're playing this thing. This guy right here made a big mistake. He pushed out way too far. You have to use this hill a little bit. And even then, it's not even a guarantee because... Uh, Boy, oh, there's one right there. Uh, they can kind of like arc the round a little bit. Oh, I bounced. Uh, come on. And he sees me. Okay. Okay, that was a bad hit on my part. I do have a way better reload than him. There, right there. Lower glazes. And boop. Beautiful. Right there. Lovely. But yeah, if they get smart and they can arc the round, uh, it can kill me. Very quickly, just saying. Ooh. Ooh, okay. Don't know where those are. See what I mean about ammunition? Gotta go easy with it. Ah, overpressure, of course. I just realized our entire team is, uh, is on the side of the map. That's not good. It's not good at all. These guys, I'm gonna try to wipe them out a little bit because I think one of them is going for the spawn camp. There's one. And gotcha. Stay there, stay there, stay there. No, oh, bad shot. Stay right there. Come on, come on. Bad shot again. I got him tracked, though. I look at that BMP. That overpressure is a pain in the ass. Oh, boy. Incoming. Got him. Perfect. Uh, gotcha. Right here. Nope. Bad shot. Looks like it turns. Oh, my God. There's so many targets. Incoming. Ooh, bounce. Really? You're killing me here, Gaijin. And fire again. Track shot. I think where the mango round ain't this good at distance. Mm. I hear a bomb. No, that's just me. <laughs> I thought I heard a bomb. <laughs> I'm gonna nail this guy, I promise. I'm walking the shot right now. And a boop. There's a perfect hit right there. I'm gonna put it right in the same spot again. Oh, incoming. We're okay. Wait, what am I repairing? Come on, come on, come on. Fire, fire. Nope, he's he's gone, he's gone. Come on. 
Give me a shot on this guy. Oh, God, I'm sorry, guys. I know I keep it in the same damn spot, but... Come on. Oh, they got him. Never mind. Beautiful. So you want to see what it's like in uh, 9.7 right now? That's... This is what you can expect when you play around this BR at this given time. Please keep that in mind if and when you decide to purchase this vehicle. Targets? Multiple. I got one in the open right there. I got one in the forest. I got two. Oh, God, I've got so many targets. All right, let's go after this guy first. And a good hit. I'm going to leave him right there. I'm going to go for this guy next. Perfect hit. Go for him one more time. Lays. And that should get him. No, just fuel tank, of course. And I'm going to put it right in his driver's port if I can. Perfect. Oh, it was a, it was a 120. He's got a, a, another friend right here. I can't really find him. Maybe he gets him. Oh, he got him. Perfect. Well done. Another one. I don't know what it might be. Oh, no, no, no. He's, he's, oh, he got it. Yep, he's smart. BMP firing. Hey there. Nope, it's BMD. Oh, God. We're okay. I got his engine, though. Unless someone bombs me. Yep. Thanks for taking that hit from me, buddy. But I'm immobilized, so you know what that means. He's coming back for another shot on me. Ooh. Ooh. Yep, 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 yep. I, I thought someone shot at me, but... Uh, I'm dead. Nope. He potatoed his shot pretty hard. That. Yep. Nords. Gotta love how bad they are, huh? <laughs> no, seriously. Nords are really bad. Who is shooting me? Where? All right, I'm up. I'm up, I'm up, I'm up. You want to duel? Come on. Where are those shots coming from? Let's duel. I think that's one of them. But that's not the one that's hitting me right now, I think. There's one right here somewhere. Ugh. Took you four tries on that, buddy. Just saying. Well, there you sort of have it with the Challenger Desert Storm. I, I would be a little bit more optimistic about this, but in truth, it's... Uh, it was kind of a pain in the ass to play this thing. And not because, you know, the Chatley is a bad vehicle. It really isn't. I mean, granted, it doesn't really fit my own play style because it requires you to play this vehicle in a very specific manner. But currently, at Battle Ring 9.7, it is riddled with premium vehicles. In fact, I think just by saying that might be an understatement because really, it's... You guys saw the games. I showed you the scoreboards. It's a lot of premium vehicles. So my best piece of advice when it comes to this vehicle, when it comes to someone who is brand new to the game and you made it this far to the video, don't purchase this vehicle yet. Wait a little while, but even then, that's kind of a stretch because this is going to be very much the norm as more nations get their 9.7 to 10.0 premium vehicles throughout the life of War Thunder, I guess. Hell, I wouldn't be surprised if we have an 11.0 premium at some point in War Thunder's future. But for the time being, would I recommend this to the average player, to the new player? Absolutely not. If you are someone who knows how to play the British tanks, it makes for an amazing 9.7 lineup. I mean, granted, it's not the best, and I could make it just a little bit better, but this is a pretty damn good lineup for the time being, and one of which I would say, yes, it is worth looking into. But if you want right now to go into the grind, don't do it. Just, I'm sorry, this is a really bad time to get this thing and use it to its maximum potential because everyone and their grandmother is playing a premium vehicle right now since the update dropped not even a week ago and it makes for a very rough experience and i would hate to have players leave this game because they play a vehicle that they thought was going to be good but really it it isn't because they don't know how to use it etc <laughs> that kind of makes a bit of sense so let me know what you guys think is this or was this a worthwhile introduction into war thunder is it not do you have it do you not have it do you agree with me or do you disagree with me let me know down in the comments section below as i would love to hear what you have to say about britain's top tier premium vehicle so yeah that's all i got for you guys i hope you guys did enjoy everything if you want to see Maybe much of this gameplay live. You know where to find me over on Twitch. Link is down in the description below. That's where you'll find me with all my live content. And um, even outside of War Thunder too. We're going to be doing a Universum stream uh, coming this week and weekend, etc. It's other games too. So feel free to check that out. Also, if you want to continue supporting the channel, I do have channel memberships up. There's my Patreon as well as... Uh, what's the other one? 
I think it's the Twitch sub one, right? Yeah, you know, forget it. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys so much. I'll see you not only in the next video or even the streams, but in War Thunder itself. Until next time.